Are you having a hard time figuring out what snacks to bring with you for a day hike or an overnight backpacking trip? If you've been following me here on YouTube for a while, you might remember a couple of my favorite grocery store backpacking food videos I put together featuring cheap and easy dinner ideas, lunch ideas, breakfast ideas, backpacking meal ideas, and even hiking snacks from Trader Joe's. In this video, I'm going to share with you 12 of my favorite cheap and easy hiking snacks from Costco that I'll be bringing with me on some of my upcoming overnight backpacking trips. Not only will I share with you 12 of my favorite cheap and easy hiking snacks from Costco, but I'll also share with you what the serving size is for each snack, along with the number of calories and the price of each snack per serving. And make sure you stick around until the end of the video because I'm going to share with you a bonus cheap and easy snack that you can only get at Costco. If you're excited about this video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for new videos each week about hiking, backpacking, and tips on how to help you plan your next outdoor adventure. A question I get asked all the time is, as a backpacker, how many calories per day should I eat while I'm out on trail and how much food should I bring? While I'm not a nutritional expert and there's no hard and fast rule for calorie intake for all backpackers, mainly because we're all so different, a lot of backpackers will aim to carry anywhere from one and a half to two pounds or 2,500 to 4,500 calories of food per person per day. This is just a guideline. The actual number of calories a backpacker will need each day while out on trail will be dependent on many different factors like body weight, the intensity of exercise during the day, exertion level, the type of terrain a backpacker is traveling through, how many miles a backpacker hikes each day, and how many days they plan on being out on trail. Keep in mind, the more you weigh, the heavier your pack, the steeper the trail, the faster you hike, the more miles you hike in a day, and the more challenging the terrain, the more calories you'll burn and the more calories you'll need to consume. So here are 12 of my favorite cheap and easy hiking snacks from Costco, starting with Dot's Homestyle Pretzels. When it comes to hiking snacks, I need a mixture of sweet and salty snacks. Dot's Homestyle Pretzels are a unique spin on pretzel twists. They're yummy, crunchy, salty, and have a bold flavor, which I love, especially especially when I'm out in the backcountry. They're also kind of addicting. Each bag from Costco comes with 35 servings per bag. Each serving is 16 pretzels at 130 calories per serving. Total price for the bag is $9.99, making this only 30 cents per serving. Who doesn't love Cheez-Its? These are another one of my favorite salty and crunchy hiking snacks. I love the bold cheese flavor and they're super backpacker friendly because each serving comes in an individual bag. Each box of Cheez-Its from Costco comes with 45 snack bags. Each serving is one bag at 210 calories per bag. Total price for the box is $15.99, making this only 36 cents per bag. I can't hike without some sort of cheese. I love Beecher's flagship cheese, and now they make their famous cheese in a cheese stick form, which is super hiker friendly. Beecher's flagship cheese is a cross between a cheddar and a gruyere, and I prefer bringing individually wrapped cheese sticks out on trail with me as opposed to a big block of cheese because the cheese sticks are easier to carry in my food bag or bear canister, and they're less messy than dealing with a block of cheese, and they tend to last longer out on trail. Each bag of Beecher's flagship cheese sticks from Costco comes with 18 sticks. Each serving is one stick at 87 calories per stick. Total price for the bag is $14.79, making this 82 cents per cheese stick. I'm not a big bar person. I've eaten my fair share of protein and energy bars while through hiking and section hiking the PCT over the last few years, but one bar I'm not sick of yet is the Perfect Bar Protein Bars. The variety pack at Costco comes with dark chocolate chip peanut butter and peanut butter. Each bar has 15 grams of protein and they're gluten-free. These bars are refrigerated, but can last in your pack for up to one week without refrigeration. Each box of Perfect Bar Protein Bars from Costco comes with 12 bars. Each serving is one bar at 340 calories per bar. Total price for the box is $19.99, making this $1.67 per bar. One of my all-time favorite hiking snacks and non-cooked lunches out on trail is a good old peanut butter jelly sandwich, but I hate the crust. You can either buy the pre-made Smucker's Uncrustables at Costco for $14.49 for a box of 18, or you can make your own. I prefer to make my own because I get to pick the bread, peanut butter, and jelly, and the homemade version is slightly cheaper. I start with two slices of wheat bread. I prefer using wheat bread over white. Then on one side, I spread peanut butter, and then on the other side, the jelly. Then I put both the slices together like I would when making a regular PB&J. Then, to get rid of the crust, I use this sandwich cutter and sealer I got off Amazon for $7, and I'll put a link for this down in the video description below. 
to cut off the crust and then seal the sandwich together, making this a homemade Uncrustable. I like making these in bulk and then freezing them in one of my stasher bags. This way, whenever I'm packing hiking snacks or a non-cooked lunch for any of my day hikes or overnight backpacking trips, all I have to do is grab a couple of these out of the freezer, add them to my food bag, and then they're thawed and ready to eat by the time I'm ready to devour them out on trail. I get a two pack of bread, peanut butter, and wild huckleberry jam from Costco for a total of $28.97. This allows me to make up to 24 Uncrustable sandwiches. Each serving equals one homemade Uncrustable at 420 calories each and comes out to only being 79 cents per sandwich. Beef sticks are always a tasty, easy hiking snack, and they usually have a good amount of protein in them. Recently, I picked up a bag of the Country Archer grass-fed mini beef sticks. They come individually wrapped, are the perfect size for a quick hiking snack, have zero sugar, are gluten-free, and have four grams of protein in each stick. Each bag of Country Archer grass-fed mini beef sticks from Costco comes with 28 mini beef sticks. Each serving is one stick at 45 calories per stick. Total price for the bag is $16.79, making this 60 cents per stick. Another beef stick at Costco that makes a tasty, cheap, and easy snack are the Bavarian Meats Little Landjäger Hardwood Smoked Meat Sticks. These don't come individually wrapped and need to be eaten within three days of opening or kept in the refrigerator. These meat sticks also have zero sugar, are gluten-free, and have nine grams of protein per serving. Each bag of the Bavarian Meats Little Landjäger Meat Sticks from Costco comes with 32 meat sticks. Each serving is two meat sticks at 120 calories per serving. Total price for the bag is $13.99, making this 87 cents per serving. Another super tasty and easy meat-based hiking snack I love getting from Costco are the Golden Island Korean Barbecue Snack Bites. Oh my god, these are so good. They're full of flavor, gluten-free, come individually wrapped in snack bags, which are perfect for hiking and backpacking, and have 10 grams of protein per serving. Each bag of the Golden Island Korean Barbecue Snack Bites from Costco comes with 12 individually packed bags. Each serving is one bag at 120 calories per serving. Total price for the bag is $17.99, making these $1.50 per bag. Moving on to some sweet hiking snacks. If you're like me and love s'mores, you'll love these Kirkland Signature S'mores Clusters. No campfire needed. These delicious clusters are made of grams, marshmallows, kettle cooked caramel, and are covered in milk chocolate. A serving size is one piece and has 100 calories per serving, but I usually consume these at least two at a time. Each bag of the Kirkland Signature Caramel S'mores Clusters from Costco comes with 34 servings per bag. Total price for the bag is $8.99, making these 26 cents per piece per serving. I'll be honest, the Maison Jackmart mini almond cakes were a total impulse buy on my last Costco shopping trip. I've had almond cake in the past at coffee shops and I remember them being really good. So when I saw these at Costco, I knew I wanted to give them a try. So I just got home from my Costco hiking snack haul and I really want to try these. Even though I know I just had a hot dog, I hadn't had lunch, but one of my rules is that I never bring food out on trail unless I try it first. Okay, they smell pretty good. And they come individually packed like this. So let's see what these mini almond cakes are all about. Mmm. Oh my God. These are just as good as I hoped they would be. Mm. Oh my god. Oh my god. I kind of want to go back and get another bag. <laughs> These are so good. Comment below and tell me if you think I should go back to Costco and get another bag. Because you know, sometimes Costco has things and then they sell out and they never have them again. Do you think I should go back and get another bag? Each bag of the Maison Jack Mart mini almond cakes from Costco comes with 24 individually wrapped cakes. Each serving is one cake at 110 calories per serving. Total price for the bag is $8.99, making these only 37 cents per cake. Okay, I'm a huge fan of gummy bears. It's very rare that I don't go out on a hike or a backpacking trip without some sort of gummy bear variation. On my recent visit to Costco, I saw the Albanese milk chocolate covered gummy bears and of course they made their way into my cart. These are the same Albanese gummy bears I love only they're covered in milk chocolate and they come in the strawberry banana, cherry, marshmallow, pineapple, and orange flavors inside the bag. Each bag of the Albanese milk chocolate covered gummy 
Bears from Costco comes with 28 servings. One serving is five pieces at 120 calories per serving. Total price for the bag is $13.99, making this 50 cents per serving. And if you're looking for another yummy gummy bear variation at Costco, check out these gummy bears with electrolytes. Mary Root's fruity gummy bears with electrolytes are vegan, gluten-free, have no artificial dyes, and only have three grams of sugar per serving. They're super chewy, have a ton of flavor, and are a fun way to get your electrolytes in while you're out on trail. Each bag of Mary Ruth's Fruity Gummy Bears with electrolytes from Costco comes with 15 servings per bag. One serving is 12 gummies at 50 calories per serving. Total price for the bag is $13.79, making these 92 cents per serving. And now for the bonus cheap and easy snack you can only get at Costco. It's of course the $1.50 hot dog and drink combo at Costco's food court. I know this isn't a hiking or backpacking snack per se, but it makes for the best cheap and easy shopping snack or meal you can buy at Costco whenever you're shopping for hiking snacks. Treat yourself and make sure you don't go shopping for hiking snacks or backpacking food on an empty stomach. If you like this video and got some value out of it, make sure to hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for new videos each week and hit the bell icon to get notified each time new videos are posted. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Happy trails and keep on trucking.